Well, I grew up in a city called Presidente Franco, where we live with my parents. Man say only a home, you know, just take care of me and my other sort of brothers. It's a humble family, didn't earn uh, good money just to survive. Playing with my friends every day, we're playing football in a little pitch we got on, on our place. I started playing the team with, which is from, from that city called Cerro de Presidente Franco. Every level of my career as a child there, I, I trained like uh, continually. And when I was 16, the manager of the main team uh, put me to train into the squad. Oh, man. I made my first uh, cup in the team when I was 17 as a captain in the, in the second division of, the, of Paraguay. This is a tough, tough division. That makes me uh, grow up a, li a little quicker, you know. So I want to move uh, to play in uh, other countries. So I was excited for, for the opportunity. And then a few days uh, later, he, my agent called me and said, hey, National uh, spoke with me about you and what you think about that. And they were the champions of the last, the last uh, league. And I said, oh, of course, uh, without we, my closed eyes, uh, I go. The Libertadores was, was amazing because National is a it's not as a, as a small, small team. We were a good team, we were a compact team. The fans of the other teams start to support our team because the only Paraguayan team in, in competition. When we reach the semi-final, we play against the uh, Defensor Sporting of Uruguay. And the first one, the, the first game, we, we beat them 2-0 uh, at home. When we went to play in Uruguay, it was and we, we were losing 1-0 and they uh, attacking, attacking. Uh, they hit the crossbar and it was a crazy, crazy game. And uh, at the end, uh, when the referee said the game is over, we qualified to the final. It was an unbelievable moment because uh, at the beginning, no one believed in us. And at the end, we lost the final, but it uh, was, was a very good season. One I remember uh, until the end of our life, that moment. My dream was playing in Europe. And of course, I knew that if I was playing in Paraguay, it would be too difficult and I need to do another step. The opportunity to play in Corinthians uh, appear, uh, I say, no, now it's the time. I say, if I do well in Brazil, I, I will have an uh, opportunity to play in Europe. And that was my focus. Very good group, good players, and, and we did very well in all the competitions. And, I work here to explore my potential. I got two other uh, offers, another uh, country in, in Europe, another was in uh, Asia, Asia country. Everyone is moving. Too quick, you see it's too the city is quick. My agent say, why are you choosing? <laughs> Premier League, of course. No, West Ham. We wait and finally we, we, we could uh, come here and yeah, it was a dream and I, I live in that dream. Yeah, I was 
very happy because when I was young, I saw the Premier League on, on, the, on the TV and, and the league is quick. Probably in Brazil, you got much time with the ball. You don't, go, you, you don't have the time to, to think. You have to think before the ball comes to you. When I arrived here, and uh, until now, I trade the, the game like a, a dream. I, I that I, I live in, in that dream. So every every game, when I go and walk into the pitch, I, in my head, I remember all the things that I passed when I was young, when I, when I the things that I went through to to stay here, try to do, of course, my job well, but with that enjoyment. I I, I didn't uh, believe that. I will be here. Yeah, it was a dream and I live in that dream.